the brand identity of Daily Fresh revolves around the concept of freshness, health, convenience, variety, and trustworthiness. By embodying these values, we aim to resonate with our target audience to choice for refreshing and nutritious food based products. One the types of our business practicum is uh, product development, marketing, sales and customer service, operation, financial management, then reflection and evaluation. In this section, our products is included in the food and beverages industry. Uh, the fresh fruit cocktails are frequently prepared with a blend of seasonal fruits uh, with milk or sparkling water. The fruits includes honeydew, guava, watermelon, grass jelly, and sago. They are well known for their vivid colors and inherent sweetness. The fresh fruit cocktails are also popular alternative for people who are looking for a lighter and more nourishing beverage options because they are frequently linked to a natural and healthful so this section we offer a fresh fruit cocktail that is uh, a non-alcoholic beverages that means it's halal for the muslims and non-muslim to consume because it's a fresh mix of fresh fruit with uh, milk or sparkling water and the second one is uh, we sold our products at stalls and through online and we also offer the delivery services for every purchase and uh, we offer a health and nutrition services because these products are often marketed as healthy and convenient options the picture shows our company organization chart for daily fresh on top of us is our leader Puspa Yasin Binti Hamimin as the head manager and below her is Daniel Fong as financial manager one and Beverly Michael as financial manager two. Next, we have two operational manager, which shows me, Ramo Sanatomi, as the operational manager one and Nur Hidayah Binti Aransa as operational manager two. Lastly, we have Nurhizati Binti Ratiman as designer one and Siti Rafida Ruslan as designer two. And Nurul Eva Shafika Binti Mat Rakim as marketing manager. How we promote our products? One of the ways we promote our products is through a text channel channel, especially by setting up a Expo Epic Store at the PPIB UMS. This allows us to reach a large audience and create brand awareness. Additionally, we benefit from a powerful promotional tool known as word of mouth in addition to our traditional channel and the power of word of mouth we also use digital channels to promote our products we have a strong presence of popular social media platforms such as instagram facebook whatsapp for example, we post our promotion by poster, teaser, and etc., which allow us to reach a wider audience and build relationship with our customer. Next, this is our insight for Facebook engagement with our customers. Next is what was our company achievements. Firstly, what we can see is our total sales was higher than what we expected. We expected that our total sales is 500 ringgit only, but our total sales was higher than that amount. Customer feedback are more in positive feedback, which is, they said that our product is delicious, have big portion and many more. At first, we also had a negative feedback at our starting business and we took this feedback as our strength to improve our product. Besides that, we also provided a fresh and affordable food and beverage to all students in UMS. The price will be not so cheap or so expensive as long as students can afford it and test it. Hello everyone, my name is Nurul Eva Shafika Binti Patlakim, so I'm gonna talk about the problem we are facing when doing business. The problem we are facing when doing business is the competition between traders who sell the same product with us, which is one thing. Indirectly, this will affect our group member to increase our effort further in marketing activities to attract customers. 
where we need a lot of cost and energy to ensure that it gets a lot of responses and becoming the choice of the public. Next, the problem we face is the fruits is unfresh. When the fruit is unfresh, it will affect the taste of water. Indirectly, this will harm our business. In addition, the weather factor also affects our business because when the weather is hot or humid, this will cause the fruits to become soft and the ice will melt quickly. Meanwhile, when it's rain, it will cause low demand because people tend to feel less thirsty to choice cold drinks. And also, the price of the fruits is very expensive. And the other problem that we are facing in selling our drinks is the lack of choice of flavor. As we only provide two choice, which is sparkling water, and the other one is fruit cocktail. Lack of choice can lead to customer dissatisfaction because customer may feel less interested if the choice is limited. That's all for me. Thank you so much. Next, I will present the slide of a problem solving section. We have discussed to solve some of the problem we are facing. Among the solution we have found is to modify the sell products according to the customer test so that we can produce a variety of unique products to attract the attention of customer. Next, in order in order to overcome the problem of fresh fruit, we have taken the initiative to use part of the fruit from can to avoid the number of fruit that are not fresh. In addition, uh, we have also increased the number of ice storage to prevent the ice stock from melting quickly. In addition, we also try to limit the use of plastic bag by suggesting to customer to bring their own container for conveniency and to ensure the cleanliness of environment. Thank you. Mm, suggestion for our company could do better or differently in the future firstly is menu innovation. Creative products are ones that have new unique and new flavor combination, ingredients or presentation methods. In addition, sparkling water can be revitalized by strawberries and mint leaf to providing a refreshing taste for customer. An innovative menu that offer unique can capture the attention of customer. It also increase company sales. Collaborating with influencer is crucial for business owner because influencer is one of the marketing techniques that leverage influential individuals such as celebrities, Instagram, personalities, or TikTok star to promote product. Only fresh company will provide influencer with complimentary cocktail and sparkling water for them to try and review. This influencer will create video and post it on their social media account. Strategy to collaborating with the influencer is proactive step to enhance record or unique brand image and strength our product position in the market. Secondly, prioritizing the quality of raw materials. Raw materials refer to substances or components used as the foundation or main elements in the manufacturing or production process of a product. Therefore, we will prioritize the quality of our fruits to ensuring each fruit stay fresh and high quality. Systematic customer service. Customer service refers to support and assistance given before, during, and after customer purchase a product or service. Learn communication facility, direct and personal interaction suitable for detailed discussion, email support through written exchange and live chat providers and immediate 
and interactive platform for quick queries. This will enhance customer relationship by ensuring prompt and effective response and accommodating interaction between the business and its customer. As for balance sheet, our group collect total assets at 906 ringgit and 19 cent and also total liability and equity at 906 ringgit As and for cash flow statement, the cash receipt is 1190 ringgit, then we minus cash payment at 283 ringgit and 81 cent. So the net profit generated from this business project at 906 ringgit and 19 cent. Next, for financial report, sales of cocktail fruit at 679 ringgit, as for sales of sparkling water at 346 ringgit. So total sales of our product is 1025 ringgit. For further understanding, here is the cost statement that you all can refer for our Since financial the total report. sales of our product at 1025 ringgit. This total sales divided by 8% in our group. So each person earns 128 ringgit and 20 cent and 44 ringgit and 41 cent of expenses. So total profit at 83 ringgit and 72 cent.